Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome back to another episode here at Flores Bullies. Um, I know it's been, what, like, probably two weeks that we posted. Um, we've just been really busy, been cu getting caught up with a lot of stuff. But it is finally about to be week eight on the puppies. They are turning eight weeks, and they're going to be ready to go home. We did have one sold already. Um, this little female over here, female four. But the guy that sent the deposit on her pretty much never replied. Just vanished, pretty much. And um, so she is back on the market. It's this little female right here, female number four. The only one that's been sold and that's getting picked up probably this weekend is uh, female number three, which is, if I can get it right, <laughs> it is this one right here, right? This one? Yeah. Oh, this is this one right here. This is female number three is right here. She's the one with like the biggest head. That's female no number three right there. Looking great, looking good, ready to go to her home. And then we got the other puppies over there doing their thing. That's female number one right there. You got the male, the only male. You got female number four right there. What's up, little girl? And we got this female right here, female number two available as well. So we'll hold them up individually in a second. I just kind of want to see you guys. I want you guys to see the puppies running around, playing around. They're up to date on the shots, dewormed and everything. Um, all are healthy, no problems with the vet. Look at that little girl, she's running. <laughs> oh, now they're all running, they're getting the zoomies now. Man, these are just the cutest little puppies, and they're eight weeks old already, and they're shorter than that soccer ball. I mean, these puppies stayed super small. Shout out to Hubba Bubba from Top Flight Pups, um, letting me use that pup. That dog, Hubba Bubba, he is dope. I mean, he put that little small body on these puppies, and Canela's pretty small herself. So, I mean, I'm pretty surprised on how small these puppies are staying. But obviously super happy as well, the fact that they came out really good. Um, really healthy and just staying really small just really happy with the whole litter um, at the end of the day and like I said I know I haven't been pushing them as well as like as much as I should so we're gonna start making some more videos if you're interested you can hit me up at 229-296-4058 si hay interesados en cualquier de los perritos ya tenemos cuatro este manden mensaje al 229-296-4058 229-296-4058 296-40-58 Tenemos este machito clarito que está aquí Tenemos esta hembra que está aquí Y tenemos Estas dos hembras Esta hembra que está aquí y esta hembra que está acá Esta ya se vendió This one's already sold This is female number 3 She's already sold and will be getting picked up this weekend Or the next weekend So trying to figure that out with the owner But She's looking good, man. She's looking really good. Stayed small, thick, really big head. Exactly what you want from these Frenchies. You can see now they won't leave me. They're just so curious. <laughs> I just like to get into everything. See this one over here chasing Chris? I mean, come on, tell me you don't want one of these in your house, just running around, making your life better. Of course you do. You know Mother's Day's around the corner, Father's Day's around the corner, or Mother's Day already, Mother's passed? Day already passed? Mother's Day already <laughs> passed, damn. <laughs> Father's Day is around the corner. Um, Chris's birthday is around the corner. Why not buy, buy a puppy and let, let him use that money to celebrate his birthday, you know what I'm saying? But yeah, guys, super happy, super excited about this puppy, like I said. Um, just really happy with the outcome. If you want, Chris, if you want to try to show them one by one, just so we, people can get the idea of who's who. If you want to get the male first, that's the easiest. But here's the male. Here's a close-up at the male. As you can see, he's looking really good. Nice short face. No long nose, none of that. Ears looking good. Structure's looking good. I mean... What more could you ask for in a litter of Frenchies? Just awesome, awesome structure. 
And then if you want to get the females. <laughs> she got a little leaf in her mouth, so does she. Look at those cute little things. Alright, here we go. Uh, get the two females that look alike first. So this one's the one that's old. Yeah. Curviana's right there. Over there. <laughs> You can't tell them apart yet, Chris. You wanted to do one by one. You said you no, wanted you to can, do one by one. You can get those those two. That way we don't get, get mixed up. So these are the two little... <laughs> like the way she spreads <laughs> out. <laughs> so this is female number two right here. This is female number one. This is Curviana, the little curvy tail. Or is this the one with the little curvy no, tail? No, this is the curvy tail. Oh, this is the one. Okay, this is female number one. <laughs> this is Curviana right here. Oh, what happened to my zoom? Sorry. I always zoom in randomly. So this, you can see, she's got the curvy tail. This is Curviana right here. So this is female number one. Female number two. Also looking good, looking good. They they both stayed really small and short as well. So really happy with their outcome. And just the way, the way she's Superman's, what is she doing? <laughs> you can put them down. And then you got these two over here playing tug of war with something. And the last one that we have available is this little gray female right here. Female number four, also known as Tiny. She was the smallest one in the litter. When Chris took her to the vet, she was the heaviest one. So, definitely grew. She's got a little food on her nose. They ate not too long ago. But she's also looking good, guys. Look at that headpiece. Nice little headpiece. Ears are looking good. I'm trying to step on the puppies. It's a profile shot right there, side shot. She's also supermaning. <laughs> it's funny that you just get stiff like that. She looks like she's hanging on for dear life. But yeah, she is looking beautiful as well. Really happy, really happy with all of them. Um, you want to go ahead and put them down, Chris. But those are the puppies that we have available, guys. Have you guys been doing okay? Have you guys been doing good? Um, you know, enjoying, enjoying life. For all my breeders out there, I hope you guys... All your breedings are taking, all your females are taking, your puppies are selling. You know what I mean? We, we have nothing but positivity around here. Oh, they got right up. What's that noise? What's that noise? That one over there wanted to go investigate, see what that noise was while everybody was running away. But, alright guys, I'll leave you with this cute shot of the puppies. I'm going to go upload this video. And, um, yeah, like I said, if you're interested in any of the pups, 229-296-4058. 229-296-4058. What's the little male doing? Man, just chilling right here. Look at that. Man, he's so cute. And he could be yours. All you gotta do is text us. And we get down to work. You guys have a good one. Make sure to follow on social media. Uh, Flores Blaze Official. Instagram, TikTok, Facebook. All social media platforms. And we will catch you guys on the next one. I can't get enough of these puppies though. Okay, man, that little female saw crazy to her face. And then this one. The guy put a deposit on her and just ghosted. So, his loss, definitely. But you want to be on the camera, little girl? But all right, guys. I'm out. I'll see you guys in the next video. Hopefully soon. Probably in a few, probably in a few days. Definitely in a few days.